Morning guys, uh, sad day today. Today is the day we say goodbye to my 2000 Mark IV Golf, uh, which I've had for over eight years. Um, I hit a deer a few years ago, here it is. Um, I hit a deer in the, uh, one of the back roads out in Lincolnshire. Um, I've had the car so long that I didn't really want to get rid of it. Uh, but I've had it in the garage for a long, long time. I've had all the bits to get it fixed. Um, but it's a bit of a mess at the front end. There's basically no front end on it. It's just a bare engine. There's no front panel, no nothing on the front end. So um, I've never got around to fixing it. And having the car in here is just killing the space. I really need the space back as I've outgrown the, the little office where we do all the, the videos. And um, I want to get in here and, and get this place set up properly. Gonna have to get some more power leads put in, sorry, power um, sockets because there's, I think there's only two at the minute. I need at least six. Um, the floor and walls need painting and all the crap and junk that's tucked away needs to go. Uh, can't get to any of my tools, can't get to my, any of my car care kit. So I think getting rid of this um, golf is probably gonna be a, a good, good idea, but. I was sad to see it go, really, really sad to see it go. I did a lot, a lot of miles in this, and it just kept going, kept passing MOTs. Um, so it's been with me a long, long time. So it's going to be sad to see the scrap guy come to take it away, but it's got quarter of a million miles on it, would you believe? And um, it's just not worth doing anything with. And especially now I've got the V6 Golf, so no chance. So yeah, this is the plan. Uh, we're going to move down here for the videos and get a proper rig built for sim racing, uh, get a bench built so we can do some build projects for the uh, channel. I'm not sure what yet, probably a bit of RC, model cars, um, whatever takes a fancy really. It'll be car related, that's for sure. So we'll wait for the uh, scrap guy to come and um, <laughs> we'll say goodbye to her. Oh. Hey guys, so I've had the, uh, the scrap guy just rung, he's on his way to pick the car up. Um, not not happy about it, but it's got to be done, because um, I can't I can't fix it. If I was going to fix it, it would have been done. It's been in the, in the garage uh, a good couple of years, and I've never got around to it. I've, I've had goes bits and pieces. It wasn't actually that badly damaged. It, it looks bad now, because there's no front end on it, but uh, it, it was just more hassle than it's worth. It needed a new engine, because um, it had quarter of a million miles on it and there's just no point spending money to changing an engine on a car that's you know it's a mark 4 golf five door it's not exactly a world beating chassis so um yeah it's got to go and he's on his way so i'll say my goodbyes to it and then um i'll get on get on but the resulting mess is all this lot yeah nice I don't know how I managed to accrue all this crap, but um, I'm going to have to have a proper sort through it all and um, get rid of a lot of that as well, I think. I've got the um, the world's most comfortable sofa up here. I'm really glad I kept that now, because um, that's going to be sort of out here to, to lounge on. This thing, you, you um, if you sit on this, if you're even remotely tired, if you sit on this for more than 10 seconds, you fall asleep. It's unbelievable. It's like a giant soft glove hand holding it. You just fall asleep. It's unbelievable. Um, up here, look, this is where it all started in uh, 1984 for me. I was a very small boy in 1984. Scale electrics. Le Mans 24 hour, two Porsche Carreras. Um, I don't think they've got the cars anymore. Um, and I don't really want to plug in the track because it's so old and it's been in storage for so long. But I might keep the box art if I can retrieve it. Um, it's all stuck up with tape. I might make a little poster out of that. Uh, I've got to get rid of all this, uh, sell off all this, all this gear here. Well, all the car parts at least, not the um, the compressor. That stays. That's going to come in really handy for some projects. I don't know what, but um, having compressed air now, I've had compressed air in the garage. It's fantastic. You can do all sort. You can do far more with it than you can possibly imagine. Um, so that's definitely staying. I've got to get all my tools sorted out, and I've got all these uh, 
loads of boxes of um, model cars. You can tell my Porsche fascination started early. Turbo 2. Nice little Moby Dick there. Group 5. We've got a um, Sport Clutch Road, nice. And then we've got the best police car in the whole world 911 police car, awesome. And of course, we've got the uh, M1 Pro car, a favorite of mine on Race Room, and all, all sorts of other um, old stuff. I've got Genuine 1980s. This is an original um, pin board thing. Um, I've kept a lot of stuff. I've got somewhere in here. It was a 1989 Atari ST hidden away with some games. I might have to get that out for a, a video. But uh, yeah, this is it. This is the garage now. So I'm going to have to sort out the sofa. Going to get rid of that fridge, paint it, clear the floor, get rid of all this crap. And um, this is going to be the new um, studio, if you like. So uh, I will wait for the scrap guy to come and um, let this one go. This is the, the first stage done. Hmm, not happy. And like all good Hollywood funerals, it's raining today. Quite a fitting scene, don't you think? Ah, uh, Scrapman's here. He's finally here. Oh no. So here we go, guys. It's going to the graveyard. No! What have I done? 